Hello, this is Brian, Kilo Mike 6, Zulu X-Ray. This is a short video of aligning the internal frequency counter on an Elecraft K2 transceiver. I'm using an external calibrated frequency counter to verify the alignment. Once the internal frequency counter is aligned, then you can use that to align the PLL oscillator and then align the radio and set up the crystal filters. There's not much information on YouTube about this. Most of the K2 videos are either they're just using the K2 or using the or assembling the K2 from components, but not actually how to align it. This is not necessarily an instructional video. The resources you need to do the alignment are on Elecraft's website. The main two resources that I used were the builder's manual and uh, also how to use a spectrogram to align the crystal filters. Those are both under the uh, support documentation on Elecraft. Enjoy the video. I adjusted the filter today using a spectrogram, and this is the WWVCW um, uh, daily uh, message. Right now, I'm pretty much zero beaded on WWV. There's CW reverse, and then there's CW normal. I can cycle through the filters, the pitch doesn't change. And then here's my spectrogram. So that line is 600 hertz, and you can see the CW signal is strongest at 600. That's the uh, medium filter. There's a 400 hertz filter. And there's a 200 hertz filter. And that's the white filter. That's the low pass filter, and uh, there's the CW filter. So 700 hertz, 400 hertz, 200 hertz. And you can see how clean it is. There's no other noise, just the signal. And I have the DSP uh, turned off right now on this radio, so it's just the uh, crystal filters. I set up the filters for RIDI. Um, there's no documentation on how to do it, really, but I think I figured it out. Uh, RITI is a lower sideband mode, so right now I'm receiving PSK31, which is upper sideband, so you see I'm, the mode is displayed right here, it's RITI with the line over, it means uh, RITI reverse, and it's talking to my computer via sound card, and it's decoding the PSK31 ARRL bulletin, and what I figured out was the best way to do this is to start on a white filter, find the signal, 
And then once you lock it in, then I can go to a narrow filter setting. And in this case, I'm on a, oh, I just went to the wide filter on accident. 1.6 megahertz filter. Or excuse me, 1.6 kilohertz filter. And uh, that seems to cut out all the noise and then it works. Down, and you keep that down and then it goes away. Like that, but a week ago I, I was using a cane and crawling out of 